Hello, I am Mel and welcome to today's HIIT workout sweat sesh. I am currently 28 weeks pregnant. Yes, I have made it to the third trimester and I am counting down the days to meet this sweet little baby. If you are currently expecting, I would love to hear from you in the comments below. If you are new to this channel, welcome. I am so happy you were here. And don't forget to subscribe and of course share this workout with others who would enjoy it as well. And if you've already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and being a part of this community. It is so wonderful to have you back. For today's workout, you do not need any weights. They are optional. I'm feeling strong today and I'm ready to get after it with you, so I'm choosing to use three pound weights. Again, make sure you are always listening to your body. If you feel dizzy, if you feel any discomfort, slow down or stop. Make sure that you have been cleared by your doctor or midwife. Let's go ahead and get this party started with that warm up. So meet me in a nice jog. So we're gonna do this nice warm up here together today. You're light on those toes. I am going to give you options throughout this entire workout today. So honor yourself where you are in this moment. And remember our energy levels, our hormone levels, everything is fluctuating throughout this pregnancy. So always make sure that you honor yourself where you are today in this moment, in this workout. Great job. So you can just kind of keep the toes on the ground and bend the knees, pump the arms if you want to get that heart rate a little higher. Now, I'm not sure where you are in your journey or in your fitness journey. So make sure you're keeping an eye on your heart rate. This workout is safe and effective for all trimesters. Whew, it's good to stay strong and healthy for ourselves and certainly for our baby. We're gonna jack it out in two and one. Let's go jack it out. Now, you have this option, which is gonna be a little more intense or join me, step out side to side. There you go. I'm choosing to step out side to side, honestly, so I can talk <laughs> while I do this with you. Yes! Keeping that core nice and engaged the entire time. You can make this movement a little smaller. There you go, whatever it is you need. Rock on, mama, let's go. Woo! <sighs> Shoulders down, away from the ears. Feels so good to move this beautiful body. We're doing it. We are creating and growing life. How absolutely incredible is that? Come on, we're almost there. Moving on. We're going into those butt kicks in three, two, and one. Let's go into those butt kicks. Two options, take it back. Pump those arms or back back. There you go. I'm going here today again because I'm going to kick up the intensity as we get into this workout. Woo! So we're going to do 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off. Again, take breaks whenever you need to. Have that water close by. You can see mine over here. Good job. Yes. Quick and effective. I love these. Sometimes our energy is a little lower. Sometimes we're short on time. But the important thing is you chose to show up and we're moving that body. That's what this is about. All right, my friend, it's three, two, and one. Take that quick break and then we're on. We're gonna party like the rock stars that we are. Let's go. Mm. So we are beginning with a side step. Grab those weights if that's what you're using and you're stepping out side to side. Here we go. It's two, one, side, side. Yes, now if you don't have weights, you are still reaching out. You can make this movement as big or as small as you would like. The further you step out, the higher that heart rate will be. The bigger the motion with the arms is the same. Core is still engaged. Be mindful of the knees here. 
Be mindful of that low back. If you are having any low back discomfort, breathe. Yes, use the breath to connect with the body, connect with the movement, and you take a pause. Just like that, you've already completed that first one. Hiya, way to go. Okay, next one, knees lifting in the center. You can join me with the weights with bicep push-ups. Let's go up, up, or do the movement with the arms. No weights. Yes, using the lower abdominals to lift. Amazing here, yes. Having those goalpost arms. Be mindful of the arms here. Notice the placement of the shoulders. They're not forward and they're not too far back. We don't want to hyperextend there. Whoo, come on. Almost there. I should get a bigger clock in the back so I don't have to watch the time on my watch. Here we go. It's three. Yes, two. Whoo, and one. Great job. This time we're going to do a static hold with that right thigh with a tricep kickback. If you do not have weights, do the same motion. Get into it. Let's go back, back, back. Yes. Now, if you want to incorporate more cardio here, in, out, in, out. Really having that rooted grounding energy into that right heel. You should be able to wiggle the right toes. That's how you know all of that good energy is in Ooh, that right heel. Come on. There you go. You're almost there. Beautiful. You've got it. Squeeze it like you mean it. Weights or no weights. Come on. You're there in three, two, and one. Way to finish it. Doing the same thing, just the other side. How you doing? You look good. Let's go. Ground into that left foot. Set it up for success. Let's go. Back. Yes. Again, option to stay low and just kick it back. What I'm looking for is that nice isometric hold on that left leg. We really want to be working the quads, the hamstrings, the glute here. If you feel strong, take it a little lower. There you go. You can be higher. A-okay, mama, come on. Notice the diagonal in my upper body. Shoulders away from the ears. Come on, you're almost there. Keep going. You have that break coming up. Oh, so incredibly soon. You've got it. And you are there. Way to go, way to finish it. Option if you have those weights to drop those weights or hang on to them for some oblique work. <sighs> Standing obliques on the right side. Let's go, ground in that left foot. <sighs> yes, squeeze it like you mean it. Again, drop the weights, baby lift. You do not have to reach the arms as high. You do not have to lift that right knee as high. Come on, it's whatever you need. Let's go. My friend, you are ticking the time off of this clock. Keep going. Breathe. Maybe that's just coaching myself today. Maybe you're doing fine. Come on, you're almost there. Five seconds, let's go. Woo! And beautiful one. Great job, take that quick break. And that left oblique is feeling a little jealous. So we gotta even it out, come on. Good work, here we go. Standing solid in that right leg. Let's do it, pump, pump, yes! Right there. Remember your options, smaller step, smaller arms, weights or no weights here. Totally fine. You look good, yes! Come on, you're almost there. Work it out, you're doing amazing. 
lifting with that left oblique. Come on. Yes. You're there so soon. Woo, keep going. You got it. Reach for the stars. Reach for the goals. Reach for that finish line and break. Woo. Good work. Okay, next one. We're doing like a box step squat with punches. Again, weights or no weights, totally up to you. Here we go. It's two and one. Squat, walk, walk, punch, punch, back, back, punch, punch. Now, you can pick up the pace. It would look like this. Walk, walk, punch, punch, back, back. Yeah. Go where you need. Come on. Yes. Come on. Yeah. Looking good. Shoulders away from those ears. Yes, those quads are burning. Woo, that's how you know you showed up. Your body is telling you you are alive. You are well. You're doing it. Ha. Keep going. If you don't have those weights, still punch it like you mean it. Whoop, whoop, let's go. Almost there, yes, and pause. Good job. Here we go. Gonna kick out in front of us. You can do steps, you can do kicks. I'm gonna drop the weights. Here we go, kick it out. Now, maybe with the incontinence, this is too much, you can kick. Use those arms. Good job. There you go, come on. Looking good, lifting with that lower abdominal. You know, at this point in the pregnancy, I wanna keep trying to fight those pants to be up, but they just wanna go <laughs> below the belly. So we'll see where they end up. You know, that's all right. Come on. Almost there, five seconds, let's go. <sighs> you look good. You got it, two, one. Good job. All right, if you've got those weights and you want to keep incorporating those, we're going into a plie squat. Stepping out side to side with bicep curls. Here we go. Out, in, out, in, yes. Now, when you are squatting out, I want you to think about that sacrum, that coccyx bone at the bottom of the tailbone going down to the earth. I'm going to show you a profile. So you notice how I still have that string coming out of the crown of my head. There you go. Be mindful of the knees. Not want them over the ankles. They can go a little, but we don't want to be like lean and crazy, right? Come on, you're almost there. Holy moly, we're ticking off the clock, my friend. You've got another cardio option of mountain climbers. Coming up and pause, good job. Set those weights down if you want. Ooh. Looking good, here we go. Mountain climbers, go. Now, opposite arm, opposite knee. Reaches up. I love a good mountain climber. Stay here or hop it out. Yes, maybe you do a few hops. Maybe you take it back a little less intense. Go where you need. My friend, only one more move stands in the way of you and this incredible finish line. You showed up. Yes, you did. Come on. This is it. Let's go. Break is here in two, one. Yes, great job. Option to have those weights or no weights, totally up to you. We're squatting down, side leg lift. Each side, here we go, it's two. One, squat, lift, squeeze, squat, lift, squeeze. If you have those weights, you're squeezing, still the triceps, the back, you're sitting those glutes back. Like you're going back into a chair. <sighs> Lifting the leg to the side. Really gauging <sighs> those outer glutes here. Come on. You've got it. Yes. 
15 seconds. Show me what you're working with. Come on, mama. Let's go. Driving the energy into those heels. You should be able to wiggle those toes. Five seconds. Come on. You're almost there. It's two. One. Woo! Let's enjoy that cool down. Come on. Lift the knees. You can do a little more of a jog if that's what you need. <sighs> Focusing on getting the heart rate down. That was amazing. Gosh, I'm proud of you. Way to show up. Way to work it out today. <sighs> good job. Feels good to get the blood flowing, to get the sweat going. Yeah. Come on, you are strong. You are healthy, you are vibrant. I say that affirmation every day to my body, to my baby. Positive mindset is everything in your pregnancy. Come on. Don't forget how powerful you are. Don't forget how powerful that mind is. We're gonna jack it out slowly, side to side, cooling it down, let's go. Yes, good job. Slowing it down. Yes, good work. I hope you're taking time for this cool down. That's very important. You worked hard. We want to give our body the thanks that it deserves. In through the nose, out through the mouth. There you go. Slowing it down here. If you don't want to bring the arms up that high, it's okay. That is just what the doctor ordered for me today, AKA me the doctor, knowing what I needed in that moment. So good, selfishly, I was doing it in this workout and I was like, you know what, let me record this for my people. All right, let's take the feet back, a little butt kicks. So, as always, I know there's so many other channels for you to be involved with, for you to sweat with, for you to find support with. It means so, so much to me that you have chosen to be a part of the soulful community. <sighs> I really, really appreciate it. I do not take it lightly <laughs> that you chose to be here with me, so thank you for that. Don't forget to share this with others who really would need this. And you know, whether you're expecting or not, this may be a great workout for somebody, so share it anyways. Yeah. Good work. You've got a nice little stretch coming your way, and you're out of here. And good job. Go ahead, let's do some nice plie reach-ups. Here we go, bend down, and reach up, inhale. Exhale down, inhale up. Inhale up. This time, my friend, exhale, take it down. Maybe walk the feet a little wider. If it's accessible, take those forearms to the top of the thighs for that inner thigh stretch. Or you can be on the palms. Maybe do a gentle little mid-back twist in that thoracic spine. Shoulders away from the ears. Maybe gently take it side to side. A lot of times we'll have low back problems because our hip flexors, that psoas muscle, is way too tight. Good work. Yay. All right, let's walk it in. Toes, knees, and hips all in the same direction. Inhale, come up. Exhale, forward fold. Bend the knees here if you need to. Flat back, really feel that hamstring. The glutes opening here. Amazing. Use a wall, use a chair here if that's what you need. Notice, flat back here. Great job. Staying flexible, staying strong. And bend the knees if you need to, slowly come up. Let's give yourself a quick little quad stretch. Again, use a wall, use a chair if you need to, certainly. The center of gravity changes 
as these bellies continue to expand. So you may need to have some additional support. And let's switch, shake it out. Ground in that right foot, take a hold of the left. And great. If you feel you need a deeper stretch here, depending on your flexibility, you can squeeze the glutes. It'll open that hip flexor and that quad just a little deeper. Be mindful not to overstretch. Your body is already producing more relaxing hormone than normal, so you already have increased flexibility. And let's release. We work those arms some, so let's clasp the hands behind us. Take the knuckles down to the earth. Open the chest. This is just a good one either way. We do so much texting and typing. Let's really open the heart. Good job. And release. Shake it out. Quick tricep stretch. There you go, cross the right arm over the body. You can take that gaze over that right shoulder. Beautiful, and release, switch. Left arm over the body. Hopefully the mic's not getting muffled there. I've had that issues a few times recording. Sorry about that, just real life, you know. Please shake it out. You did it. I am so incredibly proud of you. Thanks again for sweating with me. Thanks again for choosing me to be a part of the Soulful community and this amazing sweat session. Again, if you've not already, please subscribe to the channel. Share with others who would enjoy this. I am Mel with Soulful. Thank you again for being here and I can't wait to sweat with you again as well as baby also incredibly soon. Have an awesome day.